any, any, any weird Twitter interactions? Anybody tweet something weird mm. at you, or maybe an argument over Twitter or something like that? I, I don't normally like enter into arguments just because right. it's we're like, nice guys. Yeah, like, yeah, because yeah. I just don't like to fight in the first place. Yeah. I'll just sit and remain silent. But it's like, but what I have is because I run a podcast, unlike the paranormal and the occult, and I'm yeah. doing Pretty Face. It's like Pretty Face is like I'm a demon, so it's like, and I talk about Satanism a lot on my podcast and shit like that. And that's fine, you know. Yeah. But there's these two girls that have been following me, and they basically they they, they basically said that they want to ritualistically murder me. <laughs> my blood. And he's like, after what? And, just, and it's, let's it's, get it clear, these are fans. These are fans. <laughs> they love the stuff. You know, it's like so. It's like one of those things where it's like we're talking about. Like, do I respond? Do yeah. I say to them like, hey, you know, love that you love the show, but you know, or do you play in and be like, yeah, yeah fucking kill me. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, right, yeah. right. That would be really. They I don't know think what's appropriate. That you're like this goth dude that wants it to happen. And it's just yeah. so sad because it's like I'm. I almost kind of wish I was. I wish I was like you'd show up and I like sit in like my drawing room and I like drink like a like a big pewter chalice and it's just like and everyone just like, on. Yeah, just like right with a quill pen. Sexy yeah. vampires everywhere. It's like yeah, I wish it was my life. Yeah, I'm right. a fat fucking Queens like Polish schmuck. Yeah, I'm a comedian, do, ladies. Relax. <laughs> yeah. I'm a very silly man. Mm. I do not do this seriously. That was like and then mostly just like back in the day. I was put on this website called Chubarama.com. Okay. Was me as like they put me on this like bear website where it was like a big dude. Oh, so it was like, four dudes. It was, it was four dudes. Okay, yeah. And they went through my MySpace page back in the day, and they took all these. They were like topless pics of Henry's Brown. <laughs> and they put up all these shit. And we would, you know, like a sketch, like dressed with like like a caveman and shit. And like dudes were saying the most <laughs> repulsive. Stuff on it, just like you know, it's like I don't want to jizz in his brain. Let me ask you this: How did who 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 tipped you off that it was on there? Oh, my girlfriend. Oh, <laughs> she was in she was in Scotland for the Edinburgh French Festival. Right. She's like, hey, look what I found, and she sent me this thing. She's like, oh, look at this, like, Shut and it was up. all these dudes just being like, I want to suck on his tits. And it's like, it like there was something it's like no one's ever said to me, like ever on a face. It was great. And then oh, I told my God, manager, God. and he's just like, you know, Jeremy Piven had a very big gay following. <laughs> and I was just like, oh, that's good. He's doing a positive spin off. That's what a manager does. Like, you shouldn't really be, that's not bad. It's not bad. No, it's not bad. You could be the new Barbara Streisand. Man. That's you got, yeah. No, no, yeah, yeah, those are your people. They break people. <laughs> they break people. Like, uh, ever hear Kathy Griffin? <laughs> <laughs>